I'm gonna mill two and return a creature card from yard to hand. I'm gonna mill oh snarl. Why did they make this so hard to say? Shine shadow snarl. Shine shadow snarl. Shine shadow. Shine shadow snarl. Shine shadow snarl. It's good. It's good for like. Shine shadow snarl. Shine shadow snarl. Shine shadow snarl. Commander at Home is sponsored by TCG Player, your trusted source for all trading card games in the United States. Whether you're looking for the hottest new cards or building a collection from throughout Magic's history, there's nowhere better to find exactly what you want. Everyone knows that game stores and communities all over the world use TCG Player's market price data, so you never have to worry about if you're getting a good deal, whether you're buying, selling, or trading cards. Whether you live in the heart of a big city or in the middle of nowhere, TCG Player gives you access to singles and sealed product at hobby shops across the US from the comfort of your own home. Just browse, place your order, and watch the cards show up at your door. And if you'd rather get everything in one fell swoop, TCG Player's Direct program lets you get all the cards you want in a single envelope, authenticated and conditioned by their specialists. And with their buyer safeguard protection, you're guaranteed to get what you ordered in the right condition or your money back. So if you want to support Commander at Home while putting together Commander decks to play at your own home, head on down to the link in the description. And welcome to Commander at Home. We invite you into our home to play some Commander with our friends. If you enjoy the show and you want to help support us, check out our Patreon. You get early access to every episode as well as other cool perks. You can check it out at patreon.com or head down to the link in the description. If you don't want to give us your money, that's fine too. You can do the like, comment, subscribe, engage on other social media stuff, or just watch this, leave it on in the background. It's helpful. Thank you. <laughs> Hi, friends. Hi. Thanks for having us. You're the friends that we're playing with in the house today. Hello. We're the friends. Yay. The aforementioned friends. Hi, I'm Rachel Weeks, friend of Olivia Gomerex. Yes. I host day ever. <laughs> Official, you said it, it's recorded. <laughs> I also host the Command Zone podcast, so you may recognize me from that show or Game Nights or Extra Turns. I've also been on this show before. Mm -hmm. Exciting to be here. Today I'm playing Dihada, Binder of Wills. So this is a Mardu Legends deck. It's super aggressive. It hopes to get some really powerful creatures on the battlefield and attack for the win. Hello, my dear deck masters. I'm Aaron David here to play a Richard Garfield game <laughs> with Stang, Echo Warrior. Uh, he will be making a copy of himself and everything he's wearing. <laughs> It's like copying his own fashion sense. Yeah. yeah, it's just, you know. We love brothers in match. <laughs> yeah, they do, they do everything together. <laughs> Hi, we're Stang. <laughs> I am playing Narcy Fable Singer because I can't get away from playing enchantments. This one has sagas in it. It does. That's different. It says that on the card. <laughs> it's different. It's not the same. There's no other enchantress things in here. Today I am playing old Stick Fingers, who is sort of new Stick Fingers. Got some some spicy new stuff from the last time we played it on the show. One of my favorite decks. Uh, got, does some cool graveyard stuff. I, I hated every other graveyard deck that I built, but wanted to play with cool stuff like Ghoul Tree. So I just decided <laughs> to pile a bunch of stuff in my graveyard and use it from there. So that's oh. the plan. Stick thing. <laughs> we, we were joking before uh, before the episode that it, that it was like, yeah, is this an old theme deck? Does it have like old Ruts theme? <laughs> 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 old, old, yeah. Ooh. Old, yeah. Old. <laughs> Olivia's favorite. Just put one red. She's on old. It's fine. I know right. she's old. <laughs> Let's roll. Watch your business. Oop. Protect your deck. Oh, see? see, this is why I rolled a nine and almost a hundred. <laughs> Protect your deck before you wreck your deck. <laughs> 18, oh. okay. Oh. They give you bu bumpers. <laughs> Does it? Oh, oh wow. Too much wow. The bumpers. 20. Too much backspin. <laughs> 20. <laughs> yeah. oh. Oh. The call shot. Oh. Okay. Oh. Here, I'm going to try. Get From good, Hall of Famer. 14. <laughs> 14. 14. <laughs> no, you got a bumper. Are you, you, you going to do this when we're in Vegas? Bumpers. <laughs> Two. <laughs> 
All right, well, let's go. All right. Start us off. Everybody ready to make some magic? Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Draw this one. Sure thing, deck master. Forest goal. All right, wow. I will draw, and I will also play a forest, and then I am done. I will draw. Oh, most powerful hand in magic. <laughs> Tap to gross and verge, go. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. I will draw for turn and play a Sabai Triome. Tapped. Pass. Powerful right, we draw this card. Play another forest. I'm going to pay two for a Sanctum Weaver. Ooh. Adds X of any one <gasps> color where X is the number of enchantments I control. I will draw. Ooh, I drew a card that I want to play. Skull Prophet. Mm. Oh, I love this guy. So you can add mana or mill myself for two. Go ahead. That's delightful. I'll draw. Oh, goodness, my oh me. I'll play a command tower. One good weaver deserves another. So. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Twin Weavers. Twin Weavers. I will play a spectator seating, and I guess I better cast a mana dork as well. <laughs> uh, it's Magda, brazen hey! All right, bounce. All right. Pass. Untap, draw this card. Crag, 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 crown pathway <laughs> as a red manas, and then we're just gonna get out the boy. I'm gonna pay four for Stang, Echo Warrior. So for yeah. those of you who may not be familiar with this, whenever Stang attacks, you create a Stang Twin, a legendary 3-4 red and green human warrior creature token. It enters the battlefield <laughs> tapped and attacking for each aura and equipment attached to this card, create a token onto that copy. And you sacrifice them at the beginning of the next end step. <laughs> <laughs> so Man, has don't let up. anyone tell you that magic cards are too verbose these yeah. days. Yeah. yeah, never. They don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> All right, uh, I am going to play a forest and a Sakura tribe elder, and then I'm done. All right, do I do I want to ramp or? So many so Everybody's <laughs> doing it. I know. Everybody's but I could be, I could If you play things. an enchantment, you are ramping. Yeah. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it's one of those it's double duties. <laughs> Got the big brain. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you see as the trophies, they're in the bag. Yeah. <laughs> well, when you put it in that way. National champion. This is how you learn about it. This is how you get synergy right here, you know? Yeah. You understand. But I, I could do, uh, 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 uh. yeah, yeah, all right. I will tap three for uh, um, a cunning rhetoric. Mm. Whenever you attack me or a planeswalker I control, exile the top card of that player's library. You can play that card for as long as it remains exiled, and I can use mana of any type to cast it. How cunning. I know. And then I will tap Sanctum Weaver for... Two. Two. To what? To white mana. And play God Favor General. When it becomes untapped, I can pay two and a white. If I do, I get two one one white soldier enchantment creature tokens. Inspired. <laughs> <laughs> What an inspired play. <laughs> I thought so yes. as well, yes, yes. I love the idea of inspired, you just wake up, mm. you know. Oh. <laughs> I want to make some enchantment soldier <laughs> creature tokens this morning. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right, I'm going to rearrange my board as I pass to Rachel. All righty, we'll untap, yeah, drop You're turn. the intermediary between enchantments and creatures, there we go. I think it's probably worthwhile I to should get just this ramped. down. <laughs> You did! I know, but I could have ramped more. Play an enchantment. I could have ramped different. Uh, I'm going to play a cook cook combo It's Relic of Legend. <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. It's a cook pretty. combo That's pretty good. I love Titus the signature. Yeah, right? Oh, it's pretty sweet. I was like, whatever color you want. And he was like, pink. Great. <laughs> 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 Do it. Who was it that he did? Oh, he signed one, one of mine. A birthing pod? It's like a very green card, and he's like, I'm putting pink on it. It's like, I'm just okay, like that. go ahead. Did. Okay, we'll untap and draw. I gotta have myself and sacrifice this to go find a swamp. Mm -hmm. Sure. I am going to play this forest. <laughs> I nearly just, I had my commander stuck in here and almost shuffled with him in there. <laughs> See? That's the risk. Like, you have to put him in different sleeves because. Well, yeah. Yes. Brian yeah. doesn't have any different sleeves across any of his decks, and there is. That's not true. You've won. There are different types of Shiro <laughs> sleeves. <laughs> One go. day, I'm just gonna. Oh, I literally, I literally had that happen. So many of them were the same color. Yeah. I literally had that happen when I was like pulling cards from another deck, and I was, was like, "Oh, there's where the cards from my Rurik deck that are missing went." 
or they're just in another deck. There was there was one, at one of the magic cons. There was like I was I was standing up from a table and like I was like, all right, bye everyone. I just played a game with, and then like my my quiver just spills everywhere. Oh, and no. I'm just like, oh, and when everything's no. in the same sleep, they're like just <laughs> best, best of luck, my yeah, guy. You have have found a, best time a new now. project for the rest <laughs> yeah. of the weekend. Oh, I my just God. chuckled. Versus, like told you, <laughs> I saw that happen. It was at a magic con, and somebody had one of the tool kits. Yeah, and <gasps> and those are all loose, and it, oh, it just no. fell open and went everywhere. All over oh. the job site. And we were like, we were in line. <laughs> We were in line for signatures, and everybody there was like, "Remember your spot. Nobody move your feet. Bend down." Yeah. Like, everyone had to yeah. share the matter. Yeah, yeah, it was just we like, like oh, everyone's no. nervous. We all understand what way. just happened here. No one move. Yeah, right. it was. <laughs> I am going sweet. to it's pay for definitely an OSHA violation for. of that toolkit right there. Uh, I'm going to pay for and cast an Eidolon of Blossoms. Ooh. It has Constellation uh -oh. and uh, it'll trigger itself. We need to talk about our deck list. Yeah, actually, <laughs> we're going to tap it like this. You guys may have like this. There may or may not be an Eidolon of Blossoms in my hand. <laughs> not that I would give out free information, but. See, matchy matchy. Right. When it enters, I will draw a card and I will go to combat, we're gonna go to battle. I'm going to attack. <laughs> you doing Just no for that. Yeah, yeah, I am. No! <laughs> Staying, no she no cutting rhetoric. Rhetoric. <laughs> I do, yeah, you are gonna, I am gonna get the top card of your library. Oh, mm, that's gonna be quite good against me. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's actually probably well, the worst person it, uh, because yeah. she yeah. can actually yeah. use all your enchantment stuff. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll run that back, right? <laughs> that make me look good here. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna send this one. At uh, my other I just host. convinced you to not attack her. <laughs> and my beloved Rachel. <laughs> so I got a token for me. Just one, three, four not coming eight. at each okay, of you. Okay, okay, I'll take three. No blocks. Are you sure you don't want to let me use your next turn? <laughs> <laughs> well, well, you this know, a deal can attacking. be made in the. Yeah. yeah. The token doesn't trigger the rhetoric. Is it enters attacking? Yeah, it enters attacking. Oh, mm, okay. But well, it's too late. They're, they're, <laughs> the damage is taken. All right, we've we taken up enough That's of it. the editor's time. I'm going to send it the way we had it. Uh, I'm gonna move to my end step, and the Stang Twin uh, will be stopped. Interesting, I'm gonna go <laughs> Stang Twin. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. My brother! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna take the, the land from my uh, Grizzly Salvage. Sure. And I will untap. Millin' like a villain. I will draw. I love that you have your stamped cards in here. <laughs> I could not tell you what Pro Tour I drafted that. I wouldn't but, ask. Okay, I'm gonna play Frexian Tower and play Death Bloom Ritualist. Nice. Okay, cool. So, which is, uh, I can tap to add X mana of any color or X number of creatures in my graveyard. Oh, sweet. Oh. It's cool seeing this. Which is currently world. three. Okay. I'm done. Sweet. I saw Ellie wandering around down here. Helpful. Yeah, she's a uh, Ellie Bell. Hello, girl. <laughs> Hello, girl. <laughs> I know, you're just out of reach. How <laughs> fascinating. Let me work a little bit. <laughs> I'm going to Kadama's. Do it. That was the ramp you were gonna do. Yes. Okay, okay. A favorite. Oh, I feel Ellie brushing against my lap. Yeah. <gasps> Ellie grab the belly. Come here. I'm just gonna come up and do like an ad read. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Elspeth. <laughs> I would like one attention. No, she wants like at least three attention. She want, yeah, she does want multi, do multi attention. I'm crawling up here for one <laughs> Just one attention, please. Yeah. Oh. oh no, she wants to stand on the table. Everybody needs to know you're here. We do, sweetheart, <laughs> I promise. You're such a good girl. All right, there's that one. And then I'll play this one for a turn. <laughs> right back where I need to be. Ellie. Do I save what? this? I feel like I should <laughs> save this. I'm gonna save this. I will tap the sanctum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna play a chromatic lantern. Okay. And I'm gonna pass. Ramp, a ramp, a ramp. On your unstep, I'm gonna crew the Relic of Legends. <laughs> That's and not I'll, the word. I'll make a treasure token. <laughs> what legendary dragons do we have to worry about? Yeah, uh oh. Draw none. None <laughs> that like I can. Not, not a one. Yeah, think of Mardu, Mardu dragons. There's like the Peter there, the Unstable. Yeah, that would be That's unpleasant. What I can think of. <laughs> well, it's time. I'll pay four. And I am going to cast Dihada. Woohoo. Uh, I will minus Dihada. Mm hmm. And I reveal the top four cards in my library. I can put any number of legendary cards into my hand. It's a luxury suite, a Balthor the Defiled Command Tower, I and love a Godless tower. Shrine. I love both of these lands. Yeah, this is full art. I whenever also I love can luxury get it. suite. So these are going to the bin. 
for sure. Do I want this Balthor or do I want the fifth treasure? I think I want the fifth treasure. Uh -oh. Fourth treasure. Fourth treasure. Okay. Fourth treasure. I was <laughs> like, well, it is no, the no, fifth. No. It is the it's fifth. Fifth total. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, now because yeah. of Magda. So oh, I will boy. make four treasures. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. I guess I could do. I'm actually going to keep Balthor. Okay. I'm going to keep Balthor. It goes to four, and I can actually make a fifth later. Big thanks to our friends and sponsors, the Spike Feeders, for these <laughs> very <laughs> visible dots. I love them so much. They're so good. I love them so much. You'll get to six soon. Yeah. I I never know if the Spike is a one or a six. Jim uh, was telling us about that and how it is literally it has like been the bane of his existence. It has been a big decision for them. The, the, I know that. The big ones are uh, spikes on six. I That's all I'm going to do for now. Dear, oh, no. dear. All right. Trying to, try to get down now, Ellie. We shall untap. Well, I'm trying to get up. <laughs> okay. I want to be a dog token. <laughs> I like the pepper token. So I'm going to pay a green and lead with Commander Staple Frog Tongue. Uh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> what does that do? <laughs> frog Tongue is one green and aura that says when it enters the battlefield, draw a card. We, uh, we can almost the, that's stop That's the important there. part. Okay. Uh, yeah. it, <laughs> enchanted creature can block creatures with flying. Oh. Uh -huh. That'll uh, trigger itself and my idol on the blossoms. So tongue uh, reach. Draw a card. Okay. Draw a card. <laughs> Um, really? Yeah, <laughs> I mean, that's what. Look, look at this. It. <laughs> look at him. Is there better options? Certainly. <laughs> that just reminded but me of really. like one of the, the the worst lines in any movie ever. Uh -oh. Like the, the original X Men, or whatever. It's like, what you know, what happens to a toad that gets struck by lightning? Oh God, yeah. The same thing is. It's like. When anything gets hit by light. What? Yeah. It's yeah. the same thing right. as anything else. It's like, the writers. Just, was there a writer's strike then? Yeah. Like, <laughs> Do you see why I don't Lightning. go to movies? <laughs> and collapse in on myself like a dying star. <laughs> um, I will then play a mountain. Yeah, I guess we ought to do this. I'm going to add three green with my Sanctum Weaver. And I am going to attempt to enchant Stang with Cartouche of Strength. Oh. So this is another commander staple. When it enters the <laughs> battlefield, I may have enchanted creature, fight a creature an opponent controls, it gets 1-1 one, one and trample. So that would make good. Stang a 4-5 trample reach. I'm going to have it fight Magda. <laughs> yeah, uh, we forced my hand. Yeah, <laughs> so I don't know what's going to pop out I here. I don't know, but... I'm not even sure. Uh, <laughs> I will I will crew the Relic of Legends with Magda, make yeah. a fifth treasure and float uh, red. And let's activate Magda. So I will okay. sacrifice five treasures yep. and go see what's in my deck. I can go find a dragon or an artifact. <laughs> Might I suggest a dragon? Uh, <laughs> I know, I know there's a Is room. there like a Phyrexia portal in here? <laughs> oh I God, myself don't out? do that. <laughs> no. Don't do that. That would be uh, so sad. This deck has gone, undergone some changes recently. <laughs> and I know of one artifact that it's supposed to get, but I didn't get it <laughs> because I didn't know if we were doing that yet. As <laughs> a dragon. The the artifact that I often get is Bolus of Citadel, but a turn four Bolus of Citadel felt fucked up. <laughs> so I didn't do that. <laughs> but that leaves the options sort of a little strange. It's got to be Ao or Shadrix. Ao can get your Magda back. <laughs> uh, no, this is a it gets off the top of my library. Oh right, 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 okay. And Shedrix is at the beginning of my combat. It's a two five with double strike. I think I'm just gonna get Ao. I think I cut a dragon. You I mean, cut a dragon. I know. I think I cut a dragon. In this house. Get out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you gave me kisses two seconds ago. Okay. Are you too good for this now? I'm gonna use Magda to search for Ao the Dawn Sky. Yeah. So a little anticlimactic, but a good blocker. Mm -hmm. And then Magda will indeed be fought. Hiya. <laughs> All right. Uh, so with that, we're gonna move to combat. And now Stang starts doing real Stangy stuff. So now Rachel has something I would prefer to not die. So what we're gonna do is I'm going to go to combat. I'm going to attack. Brian with genuine Stang, and then I'm the going, real deal. And then I'm going to send the token copy at Olivia. So it'll be a four or five trample, but I get some ETBs when this frog Ugh. tongue and this cartouche enter the battlefield. <laughs> uh, so I get another fight. So I will have 
this fight that. No, my scalp rise. <laughs> or the big one? The, this is five toughness. Oh, five. Like, yeah, so that one. Oh my god. Yeah. Thick, thick, thick. My, my, my. Uh, I am going to activate it. Cool. And oh. then. Uh, <laughs> nothing. Five yet. toughness. And then the Ooh. the frog tongue. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Ladies, control yourself. <laughs> I know, I know. It is quite a ritualist. <laughs> a ritualist? Ooh. What kind of ritual? A doctor. And five toughness. And five toughness. So I will draw one, two, three cards from the ETBs from the okay, Eidolon. Stang twin. Yeah, Stang's no drop. We're going to see three magic cards here. Two, three. It was. We go to blocks. This many? It is four trample damage. Yeah. I'm not blocking. All right. Ow. I want to stay inspired. So I haven't done anything. Brian takes yet, commander damage. Olivia takes regular old. Just regular. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to then pay. We're just loading up on Stangs here. We're going to put sticky fingers on Stang. Oh my <laughs> Uh oh, and I feel, like, I feel like Stang is becoming a, a, a real uh, problem. Oh, uh, I draw. Yeah, I draw from the it's a dice trigger, but I do draw from the idol on. Yeah. Yes. Time to Stang ring. has mm -hmm. your attention. <laughs> yeah. It's really just that he killed my skull prophet. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing exactly. else. Mm -hmm. he was like, that wasn't me, that was my brother. He was a doctor. <laughs> my brother did that. <laughs> no, that was my brother. We're identical twins. That was my, everybody <laughs> says I'm doing what my brother does. <laughs> <laughs> that was the other brother. <laughs> the other brother's Stang. name is Stang Twin. He doesn't have his own name. <laughs> It's not like the confusion is very understandable. Yeah, exactly. It's he like keeps it disappearing at the end of turn. That guy's shady. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna pay two and or one for a basilisk collar, okay. uh, which will not trigger anything. Which means I don't. Go to, I do have to discard a card. So I'm gonna move to my end step. I will sacrifice my brother and discard a card for turn. Dex knows me. It's very. Uh, I was very excited to have a chance to play for it. I will discard a very. Verudrin Enchantress. Verudrin Enchantress. Well, I don't know if my turn's gonna be nearly that exciting, but untapped her. Uh, ooh. Ellie, are you excited? We will play Everton Catacombs. So I have Wait four in the yard. One, two, three, four creatures currently in the graveyard. Oh, beautiful. So, so pretty. So pretty. Thank you. I'm not talking to you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna That's new. old stick finger. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Is it going to lean further back every time you cast it? Yeah, First we're sacking this. Just shrink me in post. He <laughs> <laughs> spins off into the galaxy. So I take one. <laughs> so we will play old stick finger for, I believe, three. So basically we reveal until we hit three creatures. I'm just going to go with my enchantments. Two. Three. Oh, I want I want that guy. The tortoise. Nice. And then these. I love that I find the things and then the next time I see them, they're in a deck that Brian came. Like, <laughs> <laughs> didn't even get a That's chance. That's where you are, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, we're, we're gonna do this. Non-zero amount of time. <laughs> when I, did, I opened the party time pre-con just to like, yeah. I was gonna pull stuff out and he's like, hey, you know that deck you were gonna open? Uh, I need the black market connection. So I took it, I'm like. Yep. That's the good one. Got her. Couldn't have possibly been something <laughs> I was looking for. No, no, no. It's for forgiveness. Fine. Yeah. It's not for permission. Uh. This is now uh, seven. So I'm going to add seven. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Here we go. Right. And uh, I'm going to play Fetch Quest off Bramble Familiar. Cool. Oh, mill and you mill and get a creature? Uh, so, so yeah, I mill seven. I put a creature enchantment or land milled onto the battlefield. Cool. Sweet. Cool, cool, so cool, cool. this is on an adventure. <sighs> oh, I oh. love it when a raccoon goes on an adventure. Just really, just, you know. Oh, cool. Shieldred. Yeah, it's gonna be Shieldred. <laughs> That's the only creature you got, right? Uh, it, it's either that or Seder Wayfinder. <laughs> I think it's gonna be Shieldred. <laughs> so these go to my graveyard. Yeah. Uh, and then I still have one green floating, which will play Birds of Paradise. Oh. I'm desperately wondering if I put Bajuka Bog in here. Oh no, please no. <laughs> I can assure you it's not in my... <laughs> and then I'm done. Huh. Ooh, it's too bad there's, bad. there's no way of up. knowing what this card does. <laughs> yeah. Because it's not in You it. don't speak Phyrexian? <laughs> this isn't the beginning of each opponent's uh, upkeep. They sacrifice a creature. Mm -hmm. Beginning of my upkeep, right. I reanimate a creature. Mm. Terrible. Symmetrical. Yeah. <laughs> you can't have my things anymore. <laughs> this one was mine. Because I have one too. Yeah, Are you, you sure? Yes. Magda. <laughs> 
for one of his stuff. What, what is in it? Maybe Everyone, the turtle. Shieldred's the threat. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I'm just making copies of frog God's favorite generals <laughs> hitting the bin. Mm-hmm. All right, how do I make this happen? Anything we should know about in your Well, there's, there's eight Brian? creatures. It's my turn. I'm just, well. I'm being worried wait. about the graveyard. I'm playing Daxos the Return. Nice. Whenever I cast an enchantment spell, I get an experience counter. And I can play one in Orzhov and get a spirit enchantment creature token on the battlefield that is PT equal to number of experience counters I have. Just want a five color random experience counter tribal day. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> They're like really hard to capitalize, but I'm yeah. so experienced. No idea. <laughs> I will play a destiny spinner, which is an enchantment. So, so called I will Master get. of None. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Next to tapped out, so I've drawn one card. Yeah, yeah and I've drawn you, one card. Yeah. All right. Yep. I have on. That stays here. I'm going to sit quietly and hope that someone else can help with shouldered pass. Uh, o- Oko's trying to get it. Do you want? Do you want an Ellie? I'll trade you an Ellie. I'm gonna untap. I kind oh, of look at what you, how many <laughs> down there? <laughs> <laughs> they keep secret, coming. <laughs> secret dog dimension. Yeah, yeah, you held this one. Girl. One, two, three, four. Are you nervous about being on camera? <laughs> at least you're not cheating. I have to sack AO. I'm gonna choose to look at the top seven cards in my library, put any number of non-land permanent cards, a total amount of value of four oh, or less remember. onto the battlefield. Uh, it's Mary, Esquire of Rohan, and this talisman of hierarchy. Mary! There's oh, a Mary! Mary's doomed, I think. Saga. I will draw for turn. That was my upkeep. I think hitting that talisman means I get to do this next thing. Schwamm? I think the mana works out if I do that. <laughs> Let's find out. Let's find out. And then I am going to cast red. Red. White. You make it so dramatic. White. Almost <laughs> tapped the tap swamp for white. Black. This ultimatum? <laughs> Black. This ultimatum. What? Ruinous ultimate. Oh. I know why. Because was the problem. <laughs> so destroy all our stuff. Destroy all non-land permanents my opponents control. Why didn't you just tell me before? Because <laughs> I didn't have the mana to do it until I sacked the AO. Oh, right. I was like, I'm one mana short. All until non-land I got the permanents. Talisman. All non-land permanents my opponents control. Oof. All GGs. Right. <laughs> GGs. Okay. I have a dice trigger. I draw one card. Cool. Neat. It's the Mardu Cyclonic Riff. <laughs> we don't have the Groundhog Day scenario with the- <laughs> no, oh I can't loop it. Uh, I'm <laughs> gonna kick Tihada up and I'm gonna give this legendary creature Vigilance, Lifelink, and Indestructible until my next turn. And I don't have another legendary to attack. So uh, AD what two. Hey. To all right, two. I gained What's two from the Lifelink and that's all I got. I will pass. Okay, I will. Draw a land? No, nope, 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 no, nope. nope. no, nope. no, I don't. Good girl, we did it, you did it. I am going to pay five. Good girl. And cast Xenagos, God of Rebels. Nice. So okay. glad, okay. Rachel, so glad. And I will pass the hell. turn. Well, there's a lot of dead stuff now. It seems like a good time for Lord of Extinction. Jesus, Whoa, Howard Christ. No. <laughs> <laughs> The biggest guy. And then also a land or elf. So Lord of oh, Extinction, five. I have. Cards, one, magic cards. cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Uh, six. <laughs> Look at uh, that. So I have 22. Uh, 22 so plus six, seven, eight, eight is 30, plus 13 is 43. That is 43. Okay. Pretty good. Math. He's pretty big. It's not bad. He's on the ground, right? I know he uh, looks like he's flying, but is he walking? He is walking. Great. Yeah. Go. Look at, that, <laughs> look at that completely clear dice. <laughs> it's the up, it's the D60. up one. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, a, it's the, yeah, the one that points okay. up is the number that's on there. And they're all, and so like it actually goes in order. Nice. Up to 60. Huh. That's all, huh. go. Get a blocker, get a blocker. I just realized how bad Balthor is against Brian's deck. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what Balthor does. It reanimates all red and black creatures. <laughs> <laughs> Like all. All. Yeah. yeah. All. Uh. The mending of the Yes, Dawn please. <laughs> I'm going to mill two and return a creature card from yard to hand. I'm going to mill. Oh, Snarl. Why did they make this so hard to say? Shine Shadow Snarl. Shine, shine, shine Shadow Snarl. Shine Shadow. Shine Shadow Snarl. Shine Shadow Snarl. It's good. It's good for like pre. Yeah, pre show. Shine, 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 shine Shadow Snarl. Shine Shadow Snarl. Shine Shadow Snarl. I will return Sanctum Weaver to my hand. 
<laughs> Enjoy. All right. I will untap. Draw a magic card. Play. Are you going to be my blocker? I'm going to put you on my play mat when the time comes. Mountain. I'm going to pay four and I'm going to cast Odric Lunark Marshall. You want to turn? You want to face your And father. I will pay another four and I will cast Cadric Soul Kindler. Then I'm going to tick up Dihada to six and I will give Odric Vigilance Lifelink uh, Indestructible and then I will go to combat and they will gain haste because of Mary. So they all have Vigilance Lifelink and Indestructible oh. right now. We already tapped the lance, honey. And you know what? <laughs> we might as well poke the bear. Brian, indestructible attackers. I will block the biggest one. Uh, the biggest one is a 4-3. Okay. I think I draw a card, right? And another, yeah, draw a card. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, <laughs> okay. I summon a legendary creature. That's a 4-3 right there. Uh, so you block this one. You've got five coming. Ellie, come here. I take five? Yeah. Okay. And I gain nine. Can you hear me, Am? Go to 47. <laughs> uh, pass. Key. Dog. Tap. Don't. Here you go. Dog. What about right here? Okay, perfect. Oh, Saga's so still out. Good girl. Now you're not on top of any permanents in play. No, exactly. <laughs> All I want stay, is stay, to be stay. a permanent in play. You are. I am going to activate my Moss Fire Valley out loud because if I don't, I will mess up. <laughs> um, this way, I will cast a Bothersome Quasit. Nice. Rachel's favorite. I love it's that. A Bothersome what? Quasit. What does that do? <laughs> it's exactly. awesome, actually. <laughs> Whenever actually, I you cast. Know. Goaded creatures I control cannot, or my opponent's control cannot block. Whenever I cast a non creature spell, go target creature and opponent controls. Gee. What creature could it be? <laughs> <laughs> There's an attractive target for that. I will then strangely cast Ordeal of Nylea targeting this bothersome closet. Okay. So that will goad. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. Uh, and this has whenever uh, enchanted creature attacks, put a 1-1 one, one counter on it. Then if there are three counters on it, sacrifice this. When I sacrifice this, I can go get two basics into play tapped. That's cool in this deck. Yep. Yeah. yeah. You sacrifice them with the Like every yeah. turn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's turn. cool. It's pretty um, sweet. I guess we go to battle. Yeah. Uh, this coded creature can't walk. Do you have anything that's like indestructible? In they are right all now? indestructible at combat. I see. Because this is indestructible and makes oh, the rest. Oh, it's every combat? Yeah. Odric is every combat, and this is until my next turn. Hmm, I don't know how to do that right now. I'm going to attack Olivia with this. One blocker. You have one blocker? It's a dog. It's a dog. It, it also has menace. It's it's I'm not getting through that. <laughs> I'm not getting through that. How much? <laughs> Uh, it is four. Yeah, but it's more than that. Oh, it's yeah, it's Xena Ghost. So it's it's considerable. It is, I guess, I could stack the triggers, so it's eight. So how bothersome. Yeah, and well, no, because this the, this is when it attacks, and this is just beginning of combat. Oh, so. I see. Oh, so so, it's, so it is seven. Yeah, seven. seven. Excuse seven. me. All right, and I eight, will then eight. pass the turn. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> She's a cat. She's a menace. <laughs> no, that has menace. No, she <laughs> is. You that has. You have other keywords that I'm trying to think of. Well, Intimidate. I can't attack you. Certainly not intimidate, yeah. maybe fear. Olivia has no blockers and would just instantly die if I attack her with Lord of Extinction. Listen. And Rachel. <laughs> indestructible. And Rachel's things are all indestructible. <laughs> It's fine. <laughs> I understand. You also have Ellie in play. And like, I do. you know. Like, huh. I can't, I can't attack Ellie. Just look at her. Yeah. She's too cute. You I can attack me with scratches, huh? All yeah. right. I'm going to start with yeah. oh my God. Cabal oh, Ritual okay. for five. Just stay yeah. right here. You don't Six, get to be on the seven, table right now. Eight, nine, ten. We're going to old stick fingers for six. All right. Actually, we're going to old stick fingers for four and replay the Baron Bull Familiar. So what is that? The one. Oh, that's the mill one. You get damage. Cool. Uh, is Lord of Extinction non static? Hmm? It goes up or down based it, on? Yes, yeah. it is. Yes. So these all go to my graveyard. These get shot. Star, star, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Uh oh, you, you moved Ellie okay. off the table. Now you don't know. Now, now she's out there to block. Now you got me block. <laughs> <laughs> um, if it would make a difference. But at least you have experience. I was, I was experienced. And I will play the Bramble Familiar. Nice. That card's cool. Sometimes them's the beats. Sometimes your friend Ruinous Blast. You know? I know. <laughs> It, it has to attack too. I can't. Like, it is goaded. So I, I can't just. I can't just hold it back to just block. Do yeah. it. Okay, fine. I'll kill you. <laughs> the law. 
part of extinction <laughs> comes am, for us I am all. so extincted. Okay, go. All right. This I, deck's cool, I promise. I want to have. It's gonna draw swamp. Draw for turn. So Old Cigarette is currently a 15. He, I mean, it just doesn't sound oh, very big with the You need to readjust yeah. this because yeah. no, I did, I'm I did. no longer for, Oh, you're not there I'm anymore, not right? Present. Yeah. Okay. Normally I am minusing Dihada a lot more, but Indus Oracle is really good right now. I am going to take her up to, to her, by the way. I will make Odric <laughs> indestructible and lifelink and vigilance once again. A reminder that Dihada has a minus 11 that says gain control of all non-land permanents until end of turn, untap them, they gain haste. What? Why are you doing so she's at seven. I'm at, no, I'm at, I'm at eight, eight right now. Okay. So okay. there is time, but just saying. Graveyard counts for you guys. Yeah. Seven. Oh, uh, six. Good girl. Althor is so bad. I have 27, so, so we're at 40. 40. Oh, I should have played this second first. Ago. I'm gonna not here take Beep. this up. I'm gonna just take this dice off for a second. Nothing has changed, because I did I did a dumb. I'm gonna pay one, two, three mana. I forgot why this is in the deck. It's Lazelle. It works because <gasps> she's a planeswalker. <laughs> da, 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 da. After Lazelle, I'm gonna tick up Dihada plus two, but with Lazelle, it's plus three. And I will make Audric indestructible. And then I will go to combat. What's total power? Total power is 12. It really is too bad these didn't come out that Baldur's Gate, oh, yeah. Baldur's Gate the didn't game? happen. Yeah. Oh my God, man. It was obviously the plan, right. but like yes. lining up paper printing and, and like video game. video game development timeframes is challenging. The set is challenging. so sweet. Yeah, yeah. It, is, yeah. it is awesome. Especially with context, if right. you like me and have right. never done any That's the thing, it's like mechanically this, that's really awesome. Yeah. But it, when you don't have any, you're like, I don't care about Baldur's well, who does, this is just right. another lady. Yeah, now it makes it. Yeah, now yeah. it's awesome. It's like, oh, Lazelle. That's yeah. like she's in my party. That's why Carlac's exactly. price doubled. Yeah, <laughs> everybody's into Carlac. All right. So uh, before before attackers are declared, yes. I'm going to cast Force of Vigor, exiling Yavamaya Enchantress. I'm mm -hmm. going to hit your two artifacts. Uh, these will be destroyed. Um, I will then use that to goad old stick fingers. So it okay. can't block. It can't block and must attack next turn. Oh. Okay. Is that friend on an adventure? He's in play now. He's okay. in play. I'll move him over here so That's it's less confusing. Okay. Brian, I will send five at you, and AD, I will send seven. Okay, I have no blocks or effects. Five and seven is 12, so I gain 12. Not We're on the sure. commander damage plan for you, yeah. I think. Yeah. <laughs> And I draw a card off of Mary, and I pass the turn. I will untap. Please draw land. That's not land. You can, What's... If you could go through my board, you can punch through for un un damage. Yeah. You, you, only, you need to go. <laughs> a lot of goading. In this economy, I need a blanker. Yeah. It's okay. Oh, it you doesn't weirdo? stay goaded. Oh, I, my, my thing? Yeah, I did that poorly. We're going to go swift foot boots. Good something. Is that can't block until, is it can't block this turn? Until my next until turn. Until next turn. Because if you so goad like, her stuff, I can squish her. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm just dead. But then you can squish me. Yeah, but I can yeah. squish her stuff I, at least. I don't think I have three non-creatures, sadly. <laughs> I, don't, I don't have enough to squish her. I, I don't have enough non-creature spells in my hand. I guess I'll just play Enchantress. Mm -hmm. And I think I'm just passing. Okay, so nothing's what goaded. You, what did you go? Oh, yeah, you had that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. what are you goading with that? Goad. I guess I go the the big the lord. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Untap. Do you want to equip the boots for any reason? Um, sure, I get equipped to the quasit. Right. Sorry, Quasit. Sorry, I'll equip the boots to goddess okay. and quasit. Draw. I feel like there's a Gerard in my future. The problem is you're actually even out of range of Gerard. Yeah, yeah, she's just gonna yeah. ult yeah. Dihada and win. <laughs> oh, yeah. So we're just I'm trying to, I'm just, well, she like can't ult removal? it next turn. No, I can't ult it next turn. It's at nine right now. Okay. If you exile removal, Audric is like, that's and the only thing. My deck cannot remove Good girl. <laughs> it Green cannot red cannot. It. I know that I have a living death in the bottom of my deck. Because <laughs> <No. laughs> we hit it earlier but with yeah. stick fingers and haven't shuffled since. Yeah. What's getting you with a bunch of life? Is it like you're getting lifelink? They have lifelink okay. from this, yeah. Okay. yeah. So, and Audric is it to all of them. So yep. really, Audric is the- Yeah. Is the, stay on this screen? But he is indestructible currently. He is currently indestructible. I- Or if you answer Dihada, Dihada stops giving stuff indestructible yeah. every turn. My mana off being able to- No, I can- No, 
Uh, it requires tapping. If they didn't have to tap that, I could return it and fetch quest again. Yeah. But I'm a ma even with Phyrexian Tower, I'm a mana off this actually working here, which could potentially get me something that could do something, but... I mean, I have to attack with Lord of Extinction, so I'm gonna attack with Lord of Extinction. I will block with everything. Okay. So I gain some three, seven, 10, 12. Okay, that didn't so. work. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't work. And I will play Jarrett. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> I only have a 40-40, which isn't enough. Yeah, you gotta get to Millen. <laughs> It'll get her back to where 80 is. So what's going on? So, uh, Jared, I what can sacrifice a creature like to what's make each opponent on? lose life equal to the sacrifice creature's power. Okay. You which I'm not it. currently doing, because yeah. I need help dealing with Rachel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it also kills AD. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So, so I, am, I am done. Not seeing a way forward. <laughs> it's, this is challenging. Yeah. All right, Pretend. I will untap and draw for turn. I will tick Dihada up to 12. So up three because of Lazelle. I will make Audric indestructible once again. Uh, I will play my land for turn, oh. which is a strip mine. Oh, it's strip spots. Balthor doesn't you know, do anything. He is a guy, I guess. Do you want to reanimate all the black creatures? That seems and? like, seems like <laughs> I do. What could go wrong? Also black and red creatures. Yeah. Each player <laughs> Magda's coming, Magda's coming back. Magda's coming back. And we're already out. Yeah, you can it's hear also, Magda. It's yeah, I, will, I will only get shields yeah. rid, Magda. angel of suffering. <laughs> Those all sound like very fun cards. <laughs> I will, yeah, he's not going to do anything right now. I will go to combat. Everything will get indestructible vigilance. Lifelink, I'll send is, is that a ghost of real boy? He's close. Not quite. It's He's just shy, right? Two, uh, you at six? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Yeah. But just, just close. I'll send everything at Brian. Everything at me. Everything at Brian. Damn. What are your biggest things? A four three and a three three and a three three <laughs> and a two two. Three, three. They're just too little. I'll block the biggest thing with. Actually, ah, I need to use this. And yeah, just the biggest thing with stick fingers. Okay. Well, none of them trample, do they? Nope. All right, I'm, I'm gonna block one of those Bramble Familiar and bounce my Bramble Familiar. I, I take probably two. probably do that with Yeah, the biggest thing. Three. Yeah. So I take two and you gain no. uh, eight. eight. So eight I discarded the Signet. Bring this back. All right, that's all I have. Okay, untap, draw this. Oh, I draw off of Mary. Okay. <laughs> Dog.exe has stopped working. <laughs> We're gonna start with a Blasphemous Act. <laughs> Oh, that gets rid of everything except Audric. Yeah, so that's pretty good. Slow that's thirteen. Down. Yeah, so I that will... kills my land or elf. Ah! <laughs> yep. Is Jared also getting buffed by graveyard? Yes. Yes. Pretty funny. All right. So Please remember this. <laughs> remember. <laughs> remember this. It's actually really funny that I have four creatures that only one them. dies. So that'll trigger my goatee boy. <laughs> no, I will go to the, the worst, biggest yeah. thing. Okay. These will die. Mm -hmm. I will then. Pay five for a creeping renaissance. I will choose enchantment and return all enchantments to my hand. And then by the grace of, <laughs> of Brian Kibler. <laughs> the uh, Otta can't ult next turn. Yeah. I know the plan is to remove me as a player, but <laughs> I mean I can't remove you as a player currently. So. Yeah. I mean, if I if I goaded Audric, could could you eliminate Rachel? Should we, let, should we let him have this? Oh, if, if it can't block? Yeah. Yes, definitely. Well, I guess that's only true at, when this is in place. So yeah. That doesn't. Oh, because that's yeah. yeah, yeah never mind. Do we okay. Want to give him this card. Uh, I have to move to discard. Okay. I will discard this. Decimate that side. Like does nothing. I will draw. Oh, it's a tap land. Brutal. <laughs> no. Uh, Good draw. If I attack you, because this is 17, this is 15. Actually, let's, let's, let's recheck the total. Oh, yeah. One, two, it's three, definitely four, bigger four, now. Five, six, three. seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So 20 from us. So I have 29, so this is 49 currently. Barely anymore, barely anymore. This is yeah. 17, this is 15. <laughs> so if I attack you with both of them and you block this, you would take 32. Pretty good, and gain three, take 29, go to 50. <laughs> Okay, that's funny. <laughs> that's really funny. I, that I could literally put you to one. I think this works. You right? That was the agreement. Then we, we, it was Phyrexian Tower, our what old stick fingers. Go? No, it doesn't go to the graveyard. And I can't Phyrexian Tower something else. This I can't put it in the graveyard though. I can yeah, choose to. You yeah. Can, yeah, you can. I can choose to put it in the graveyard. Yeah. Again. 
Oh, let's yeah. stick fingers. I can choose to go put it in the graveyard. Where always want in, it to go. In order to, to buff lore <laughs> extinction. One. One. So okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. Here all right. We go. I'm going to attack Rachel with all three of these. Yeah. I am going to. Oh no! She has something. Yes. Yeah. I mean, I got five cards in hand. Yeah. Let's I go, Rachel. A million mana. But. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to attempt to despark the. Any of them will do it. Jared. Okay, so the Jared I can't sacrifice to itself is the thing. Yes, it is exile target permanent with mana. It's four or more, right? Yeah. Uh, I can. Hmm. So this is before blocks. Yeah. I mean, I, I can make it so that the ult doesn't really do that much. Yeah, by... there's not a lot on the board. Is it all permanents or it's on... non land permanents? Non land okay. permanents. Yeah. Okay, so because basically, if I get rid of my own Lord of Extinction, then that kills you. <laughs> yep. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. But you know, we're I think I, I, think I basically have to do game. that. All right, I'm going to Jared sacrificing Lord of Extinction in okay. response. Yeah. Okay. So everyone else loses 49. Oh, 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 oh no! Oh no! Rachel's I a 30. To, I got a 30. <laughs> and then I'm going to Frexian Tower my Jared. Uh, so it goes to my graveyard. Spark fizzles and block old stick fingers. Okay. Gain three. And then I'm going to play a Dakmore Salvage. Nice. <laughs> nice. <Dakland>. Right on time. <laughs> yeah. I am done. Stick Fingers is, is equal to my graveyard. Stick Fingers is equal to the creatures in mine. It's, it's, yeah, but if I steal it with Deha. Uh, yes, it would then be equal to yours. <laughs> it's creatures. One, two, three, four, five. That's not very big. I will play a Great Hall of the Citadel as my land for turn. Uh, how many cards do you have in hand? One. And it is a Bramble Familiar, which you know. Right. I suppose we do this first. Uh, Croxa. Oh. <laughs> but I wanted that. No. <laughs> I sacrifice Croxa. He goes to the graveyard. Um, <laughs> is now the time? I think now's the time that I minus Dihada. Ulting her doesn't really do anything. I'm going to minus three. Reveal the top four. Lotho, Nahiri, Plains. Flowering into the white tree. So I definitely mill this. What does Nahiri do right now? She gives me a looter. Lotho gets treasures. I think cards are better. I'm gonna put all three of these into my hand and just get yep. the treasure. <laughs> I activate the Great Hall. I'm gonna make white white and cast the flowering of the white tree. So this is a five four. Okay. I will attack you with this no keyword five four. Okay. And then I will pay two and cast Lotho all in the right order. I totally nailed Look at it. you. Feel very good about how that <laughs> how I cast those. And then I'm gonna sack that treasure. Cast a Nahiri. Mm-hmm. Nahiri goes up to six. Exile target enchantment. Tapped artifact or tapped creature. Do mm. I just exile it? Yes. I think so. Uh, I'm just going to minus it and I will exile. Command zone. Stick fingers and I will pass. All right. I'm going to make an emergency ruling and see that's not how that works and that card is exiled. <laughs> <laughs> My okay. other emergency ruling is you cannot get it on the table right now. Uh, that's interesting. All right. I'm going to play Undead Butler. <laughs> yeah. Metal three cards. Go get them. One's a grave troll. That's pretty good. I you can sack him with the with yeah. I can sack him with with cool. Frexian Tower to yeah. go get a creature from my graveyard. So I will have. I'll then have six though. I could not ramble familiar if I wanted to. I think I might just get my Lord of Extinction. <laughs> That's again. big. Right. Oh boy, Lordy. Yeah. <laughs> oh Lordy. Four, oh five, Lordy, six, he's seven, back. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. He's big. I have fourteen. I can make him really small and activate this bell for. <laughs> The life totals he does have Seems to count fine. up these cards. Yeah, oh, no, for sure. 34. 30, yeah, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So okay. 48. Big boy is back. Is. Go ahead. <laughs> and I do have the Jared in my graveyard that I can bring back. Uh, that's your second spell. So I lose, a, I lose a life and I make a treasure from Lotho. I will untap. Yeah. I'm going to try yeah. here. We Unfortunately, about all of my stuff is small. I will tick up Nahiri. I'm going to discard a Balthor. <laughs> <laughs> but why? Why? Seems, seems bad. I'm going to 
pay two for my favorite card in the deck. Goro Goro, Disciple oh, yeah. of Ryuse. Yep. Can I come over here, Ellie? Yes. Okay. Do I minus a question? <laughs> Oko's so offended. I think no. I'm going to tick Dihada up to five. I'll give Adric all of the keywords. Okay. Mm -hmm. I can give them haste. They are bigger. We've activated most things. We could go get. We tried Kroxa? to be enchanting. <laughs> I think we probably just get Croxa again. Mm -hmm. Red, black, red, black. Croxa exiling five other cards. How about Balthor? <laughs> 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 yeah. Safety three. Oh no! Get them Croxa. Five. It's okay. Croxa is back. ETB, you do not have cards in hand, right? So this shrinks. You exiled how many cards from uh, Oh, yeah. yeah I did that on purpose. <laughs> I exiled <laughs> five and I took one out. So, so six. You lose so that's 42. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, then I'm going to pay a red and give the team haste. Okay. So everybody's got haste, vigilance, lifelink, indestructible, uh, attack. I will block the biggest uh, one. You lose three from the Croxa because you don't have okay, a yeah. discard. And then attack trigger. I block you lose the Croxa. Yeah, Croxa. And I think I die. And then you take two, four, seven. I go to two? Right? Yeah, two, four, seven. Uh, oh, they're buffed because of the flowering of the white trees. So oh, take oh then I'm just dead. Yeah, I think you take another Six more. Six, yeah. yeah. Okay, then I die. Yeah. Hey! 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 Dihara! <laughs> good You're job, so Ellie! so fun, it was all good. Everybody <laughs> loved she's it. She's so good. She's it was, yeah. she's absurd. Yeah. Yeah. She's so the first time I saw that card, I think Pastry Time had that in, in his deck. Like sure. The first time I saw it, and I was like, this card does what? It's it's all going. of these I mean, things? Because once Odric was on the board, I was Yeah, Odric was not very It was very funny that I sacrificed like a 49 power. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're like, oh, I'm down to 30. Yeah, yeah that's, that's a good chip. Well, yeah. I remember showing you Dehada too when yeah. I played the pre-con on hijinks and I was like, uh, this deck is absurd. I was straight out of the box. I was honestly no. kind of worried that the game was just going to be like, oh, I have Jared Lord Extinction, like everyone that. dies. Yeah. And then it's just like, nope, nope it was definitely nope. not that. <laughs> you, this, game, this deck sort of incidentally gains a lot of life. Yeah. So it, yeah. it's like, you're like, why is he, none of your cards say gain life. I was like, I know, it's, it's this. Uh, <laughs> no, that's cool. Jeez. Stang was so scary there. Yeah, it was pretty good that stang was, game. That was pretty good, pretty good stang. You did get some yeah. serious stang yeah, going yeah. on, yeah. Some fights and <laughs> yeah. some frog tongues. Always yeah. good. I got to cast a saga, right? Uh, <laughs> <One> saga. <laughs> <laughs> the saga <laughs> begins and ends. And ends. <laughs> That'll be it. Yeah, so the first chapter is I mill some and I get a lamb. The second chapter, chapter is like, I die. die. 43 <laughs> to <this. laughs> it's, a, it's a good book, but it's a short one. It was, yeah. it was in fact the ending of Dominaria. Yes, yes it was the ending. Yeah. Yeah. Well, friends, thank you. Thanks for having Thanks us. Thanks for having Anything us. Anything you want to so, uh, share? Yeah. 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 Listen to the Command Zone podcast. I'm hosting it and, and have been running most of the of, of what we talk about and it's a ton of fun to record you get to see jimmy and josh and a whole bunch of our team so uh make sure that you're watching the show yeah um watch my <laughs> short films on the internet <laughs> where would they find those yeah. if they're they would for find them? them at my website aaron david defazio.com we'll put it they're in all there. around 10 years old now <laughs> They're great! <laughs> I have to say, this is the first time I actually learned your name and not just AD. Yeah. yeah we're, trying it, we're trying to keep it convention simple. Right, AD, I got that. Yeah, got gotcha. it. All right, all right. Well, thanks, Deck Masters. This was yeah. fun. Yes, wonderful being here. Thanks, Robert. Yeah, yeah thanks to you guys for coming. And thanks, of course, to all of you at home for watching. We appreciate the support. If you want to check out Patreon, subscribe, all those things, do it. One we'll call to action. Do one of those things. Yeah. We'll see you next time. <laughs>